Hey, Dejan, how's it going? Good, how about you? I'm good, I'm good. I wanted to start with uh, the defense as a whole. I think there have been times you guys have maybe started uh, the couple of Big 12 games and actually gotten a couple stops. What do you think it is that, that's making it difficult to kind of, you know, keep going back out there and, and keep forcing punts or field goal attempts? Um, we just got to keep doing the same thing that we're doing. Like, we just got to keep up the energy. Like, we have a good defense, so, like, we just got to keep doing the things that we're doing. We just got to keep that momentum up that we have when we start the game with the same momentum. Yeah. For sure. What what has it been like for you being a redshirt freshman, getting the opportunity uh, to make plays, you know, whether it's forcing penalties on the other team, getting, you know, in the backfield for tackles and sacks? Um, well, it's been, it's been very, it's been a blessing. Honestly, it's been a blessing. Um, can't do nothing but thank God and thank Coach Miles now for bringing me here. It's been amazing that I had to come in my first year and got a chance to learn and everything like that. And now, it's paying off on the field, so. Hey, Dejan, in the off season, or from your first year, you've really transformed your body. Can you talk about the weight loss and how you did it? Um, from when I got here, I was 370, 310 today. Um, I lost 60 pounds. Um, it was when I was here, Miss Stacy, uh, and back home, like Miss Stacy, um, coaching them, they always stayed on me about my weight, my family, my family and them, like if I eat something, They'll be like, nah, you don't need to eat that. That's not good. And um, just doing extra work, like just running harder, lifting harder, things like that. Like just having that goal in mind and just get into it. And how has that changed your game? It's changed because I feel a lot quicker and a lot faster. Like it's it's changed it. It's a good change. Like it's, it has helped me. It, it has helped me. It's helped me. Are, are there any things you, you used to eat that you just can't eat anymore and you maybe there's some <laughs> regrets, but it sounds like you're pretty happy with the results, even if there are? Um, well, I'm from the South, so, you know, we eat a lot, of fr a lot of fried chicken and stuff like that. But, like, I had to cut out on all that, cut out on, on all the fats and stuff like that, like fried chicken, collard greens, cornbread, all that stuff like that. I had to cut out on eating that and just did lighter, eating lighter and stuff like that now. Dejan, you've only been playing football for what I think Coach Elliott said maybe two years. So, how much better can you get, and how much more are you learning every week? Um, I'm learning more every week because I played. Yes, yeah, so I played two years. Um, this is my third year playing right here. I played my senior high school last year and this year. Um, every week is getting like I'm getting used to the pace and things like that. Like, and the coaches like how they teaching everything like. It's helping me a lot. Like I'm getting smarter and smarter every year, every week. It's the best thing about that. Hey, how did you go so long without playing football? Why Why did you start start the game so late in your uh, athletic career? I thought I was a basketball player at first, but like everybody was like, "Nah, you ain't no basketball player." Like one specific thing, like I got. If you ever played basketball, like and you got crossed over, like I fell, I fell on my butt. So like that was like the end of that for me, like. I didn't want to get embarrassed like that anymore. So that's why I tried football my last year. So th before that, there weren't any, like, uh, hesitancies about playing football. It's just that you were so invested in basketball that you just didn't have time for it? Or I mean, I thought about it, and my coaches then was – the coaches at the high school and all them, like, they was talking to me about it, my family. But, like, I just really thought I was a basketball player. So, like, I didn't even give football a chance until my last year. Was there a certain basketball player you like to, you know, mimic your game after? I like Damian Lillard. That was my favorite basketball player. But before him, I liked the Magic Johnson. That was my – I used to practice on the passes and all that stuff like that. That was my favorite. Those were two of my favorite players. Well, what position did you play? Well, like – I play, I play like the four, the three and the four, but like I play like I bring the ball up sometimes. So like I consider myself a point guard. You feel me? But like I played the three and the four. That was my real position, my main positions. So you're a Draymond Green out there? I ain't gonna say all that. No, <laughs> I ain't gonna say all that.
Uh, but yeah, how would you say the coaching is different uh, in terms of the transition from basketball and then to football? Um, I say like football, like it's like it's about the X's and O's, and like basketball. I mean, basketball is about that too, but like it's different. Like basketball is way more simpler than football to me. I feel like. Cause like it's only a certain amount of things you can do in basketball, but in football, it's a lot of things that you can do in football. So, anything else for Dejan? I guess just for the defensive line in particular, what did you all feel like you accomplished during that bye week? Um, we felt like we accomplished a lot of things, like getting our technique better and things like that, and um, just focusing on the things that we need to focus on from the previous games. We got those better. We, we fine-tuned those up this week. Hey, if I'm remembering correctly, did you say maybe before last year you, you had a brother who maybe helped you kind of settle on football too? Was that part of the, the conversation there? A, yes, sir, my brother. Uh, my brother, Eddie Terry, he um, played um, football at Western Kentucky. Things like that, yes, sir. He played football for a while. What was his advice to you? Yeah. Um, his advice was just like, like everybody else was saying, like, you too big. Uh, like, you, like, back, well, he didn't say I was too big. Like, he was just like, give it a shot. So, like, I gave it a shot. And, like, once I gave it a shot, I liked it. Like, he was just like, give it a shot. Like, you don't know how you're going to like it until you try it. And once I tried it, I loved it. So. What's more fun, uh, getting a sack on a quarterback or poster dunking on someone? Getting a sack on the quarterback, definitely. Getting a sack on the quarterback. Why is that? It's like everybody in the stands, like when you get a sack on the quarterback, like you feel like like that's a big thing. Like that was my first um college sack too. So like it just felt awesome. Like, I don't know. I can't even describe the feeling how I felt. Like it was amazing though. Like it was amazing. Dejan, when you committed to Kansas, what other schools were recruiting you or were there many? Um I had a couple on um, Tennessee. Um, I was getting recruited by LSU. Um, I was getting recruited by a couple of schools. Sir. Like it was a lot, so I really can't like remember like, that. Colorado and stuff like that. Like it was a couple of schools, yes, sir. Anything else for Dejan? Thanks, Dejan. Thank you.